Hello guys and welcome to your own channel on Student Life. So in this video, I will be giving a tour of University of Strathclyde situated in Glasgow, Scotland. Moreover, to just give you a bit of background about myself, I'm studying chemistry with drug discovery course at University of Strathclyde. I'm in year 3 of my degree program. So with this, let's straight away begin with the video. As I move towards the university, let me give you a bit of context related to it. University of Strathclyde was founded in 1796 as Andersonian Institute and is a public research university. To give you a bit of insight into the research, the world's first working television was founded right here at Strathclyde University. And the list of the researches done here is endless and has contributed immensely to the world. With this, let's begin the tour of university as we have entered it. So now this is a cycle parking and all over Glasgow you can see such places spread around where you can essentially rent a cycle and drive around for your own purpose and you can connect the cycle with the app. So guys this is University of Strathclyde's library and this is a place where most of the students have spent their midnight studying for their tests and exams. In fact I've got a memory test to it, I was having a test at 10 o'clock next day and I was here at midnight and I was literally not able to sleep for that full 10 hours and I was just in the university studying and just revising myself so a lot many good memories are attached with this place so now this is Strathclyde Sports the university has invested about 31 million pounds into it and this place has got well equipped gym equipments swimming pools tennis ball courts and has got all the latest sports technologies and facilities. One lovely feature about University of Strathclyde campus is the greenery all around and this is highly maintained by the university. Moreover, whenever you're in the campus of the university, you will always feel that you're in the lap of nature. You may see the wind blowing and the weather is really amazing out there currently. So now this is Strathclyde Business School. Anyone coming to Strathclyde University to pursue finances, courses, marketing, there, most of the classes will be in this building. Moreover, you can quite understandably see the university has got modern buildings and moreover, as I will be showing you later on, it has got some old architecture as well. So overall campus is really very much amazing. Now the building next to Strathclyde Business School is the Strathclyde Institute of Pharmacy and Biomedical Sciences. Anyone enrolling to Biomedical Sciences, then most of the classes will be taking place in that building. So with this, let's straight away check out the accommodations of the university. So this accommodation name is Burbank Court and anyone coming for the undergraduate students, this accommodation is available only for them. I stayed there in my second year of my degree and the accommodation was really amazing. It is a shared apartment where four of you will be staying and there's a shared kitchen and shared living room. A lot of many good memories attached with this place and the weekly rent was about £105 for this place. So the building right in front of me is an accommodation as well which is brown in color. Basically you can say this all is an accommodation area of the university. So with this let's straight away check out the accommodation office. The accommodation office name is village office which I will be showing you later. As I said you can yourself see the greenery all around. It really feels amazing when you're on the campus. Secondly I still remember on some of my afternoons I used to specially come to sit on a bench here and just relax and think about myself, just introspect and stuff like that. So it's really amazing. The campus is really amazing out. So now this is the laundry area if you're staying in the university accommodation. And this is a village office which I was talking and whenever you arrive in the university and you're staying in the accommodations of the university, it is the first place you will be collecting your keys. So 
so you can see these all flowers all around the university even this building is an accommodation the brown building now this is a place where a lot many people go out there with their friends and just socialize themselves and this is basically pubs and the restaurants all around and uh, the name of this pub is Torch Bar the price of drinks are fairly cheap here so consider going to this pub whenever you're in the university and it's just a few minutes walk from your accommodation that's a plus factor out there so now the places such as the grocery stores the nearby city center and all such places are very much near to the university itself and they are just about five minutes walk from the university campus so you may say that the university of Strathclyde is just in the middle of the glasgow city and most of the places are very much easily accessible Now some of the tourist attractions which are just 2 minutes walk from the university is the Glasgow Necropolis and another one is just 5 minutes walk which is Glasgow Green Garden. Now the place which I am taking you is the one where your induction period will be going to be held and your first day where you will be just getting to know about the university and the principal will be addressing you it is a place where you will be coming. It's quite historic because the graduation ceremonies take in this place, this hall. The name of this place is Barony Hall. So now this is the one end of the university and I'll just try to give you one quick visual of one end of the university before we begin to the another one. So guys, I really hope that you are enjoying the University of Strathclyde campus tour. Consider subscribing the channel for regular updates. So this is a new building going to be constructed here. And just the building opposite to this is the John Anderson building. And anyone coming for their chemistry course, their few of their classes will be going to be held in this building. Now the path where we will be going on is one of my favorite to walk on. As you can see on this path, on both sides, there is currently around. Just on the right hand side, just below there, there's one more path and they have actually created a V pond out there so when you're moving on that path you can just see the water flowing just alongside so you can really see that the university has got a well maintained and a green on campus even this place on the right is a restaurant just down Now the building which you can just see in front of me is the James Weir building. So most of the engineering students coming for their courses, their, most of the classes will be going to be held in this university. And this building has got all the engineering labs. So check out engineering guys. This is your building we will be studying.
and this place is at the heart of the university so this is the basic center where the university lies Now this tall building is known as Livingston Tower and it has also got an inbuilt kitchen so whenever you have brought like some food from your home you can heat it up there and just essentially have your meal. Now the place which is going to be constructed here is the new Strathclyde Union. This is a place to socialize with your friends and essentially it will be a place where you will be making out your new friends when you have just arrived to the university. And the current Trath Union I will be showing you later on in this video as well. So stay tuned. The name of this building is McCain building and this is a place where you will be coming for your financial queries. This building right in front of me is a Royal College building and it has got the chemistry labs and most of the chemistry student classes will be taking place here. And the world's first working television was invented in this building right here. So as we are just moving towards the other end of the university, essentially I will be showing you some of the shops which are around the university to just give you an insight where you can essentially purchase your grocery and where you can have your food and stuff like that as well. The building on my left is a Chinese store. So this is a place where you can get all the Chinese products. So anyone watching me from China, this is a store where you need to come. This building in brown is an accommodation as well. This is not the university accommodation. However, it's a very expensive accommodation, so you must check out before booking. Name is George Street Apartments. So you've got like very famous eight ways around Pizza Hut, One Stop, Tim Hortons. And these kind of arts you can see all over the university. So the building on the left is the Graham Hill building. As I said, you can see the cycle parking all around. So the building on my right is the Technology and Innovation Center. It has got very much advanced laboratories and advanced nano science studies are done in that building. So as we are approaching towards the end of this side of the university so i'll just give you a quick visual of the university here So 
the place where we are heading towards the Shreth Union. So Shreth Union is a union of the students of Shreth Clyde and there is an elected president as well every year. The thing which it does is it organizes the events so that the new postmates and the new students which are, have just joined the university they could meet each other and just basically socialize with their friends out. So now this place towards my right which you can see this is a place where your university exams are going to be held quite big rooms This tall building is the Strath Union. So this is the place where you'll be coming out for social hangouts and stuff like that. So if you're finding some value out of this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe the channel for regular updates. So now essentially as I was taking a tour of the university, I essentially discovered this place just now. As the university campus is stretched over 500 acres, so you can well imagine it is quite a large area. It's a really lovely place to be honest with you. So as we begin towards the end of this video, I hope you enjoyed the tour of University of Strathclyde. I consider you would be saying that it is one of the most beautiful university you have ever seen. So consider subscribing the channel for regular updates and thanks for watching and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed.